Hi everyone, it's Halo 4 Tutor with another Halo 4 gameplay commentary. Today I'm doing something completely different. No tips or tricks today, I'm just going to do a casual commentary. I uh, want to share some personal information and just give you a channel update for the most part. I don't do many of these because I know that you come here for the tips and tricks. But uh, I went out of town for a couple weeks and basically I fell off the map. I didn't post any new content. I wasn't playing on Xbox Live. And uh, then I came back from vacation and I was busy doing other things and haven't really posted a lot lately and uh, so I feel bad about that to be honest with you. I mean I know that I have the best and most loyal fans and subscribers and supporters in the world. You guys are amazing and you, you give me so much support and I really like to reciprocate by posting videos on a regular basis and for the first time in a long time I just haven't done that and so I want to at least post something and I don't have time for a long tips and tricks official commentary gameplay tips and tricks but I can do just kind of a casual commentary, so that's what you're going to get today. And, um, you know, I thought it was kind of funny in my last video. I had told everybody that I went to the beach with my wife, had a great vacation, and everybody was saying, what, you're married? Uh, you know, everybody was so shocked that I was married, and a lot of people were saying they thought I was too young to be married. And so I realized that I really haven't shared much personal information with you. A lot of you are new to my channel, you know, at least since Halo 4 came out. Um, my subscribers have basically doubled in the last couple months since Halo 4 came out. And so I thought maybe I ought to tell you a little bit about myself, just so you know kind of the man behind the voice. Um, but, uh, you know, I'll, let me see. I'll, I'll just give you the basics. My name is Dustin, actually. That's my, that's my real name is Dustin. And uh, I'm from Utah originally. Um, I went to school in Utah, uh, graduated with a degree in finance. And uh, then moved to, uh, I met my wife, uh, additionally, I met my wife in Utah as well. Met her at the Super Target. She was a cashier and I was a customer. I asked for her number while going through the line. We went on a date and I haven't dated anybody since. That was uh, eight years ago. I'm now 30 years old. We've been married for eight years. Uh, eight fantastic, amazing, wonderful years. And um, after I graduated from school, got my degree in finance, uh, we moved to North Carolina. I took a job as a stockbroker out here. So I did that for a while. I've done a few other things. Uh, I've worked as a financial analyst and a data analyst and done some other stuff. Um, but basically, professional business environment for the most part. And um, what I'm really doing right now that gets me very excited is I'm actually writing a book that uh, hopefully will be finished and published later this year um, it's a book about being successful and what you need to do to be successful it's kind of tips and tricks for life is basically what it is and I, I kinda got the idea from it and the the so encouragement because my channel my my halo channel has done so well and I figure if I can help thousands of people with something as unimportant as halo maybe I could help one or two people with something much more important like uh, accomplishing your goals and living your dreams and things like that. So I decided to write a book and um, I researched for about a year. I researched all the, you know, a, a variety of successful people uh, in politics and athletics and business and um, in civil rights and all things from Martin Luther King, Abraham Lincoln, um, Steve Jobs, Warren Buffett, uh, Walt Disney, all kinds of people and looked at what, what did they do that makes them successful that maybe other people don't do that are less successful and what separates them and what can you do to be more successful yourself you know and so I've been doing a lot of research on that I did that research for about a year and then I've been writing for about another year and um, I've put down about 40,000 words so far my target is 60,000 words so I'm hoping to be completed complete the writing here in the next couple months and then maybe get published sometime over the summer if I'm lucky I mean we'll see publishing can, can take a long time depending on what you do but um, anyway, I'll be sure to keep you all updated on my book. And uh, as soon as it's available to the public, you will be the first to know. I can guarantee that. And uh, I'll definitely be sharing with you uh, any information you need to get your hands on a copy of the book when it's ready to go. So uh, I'm definitely much more focused on finishing that book right now than I am on contributing to my Halo channel. Because um, the book's just much more important. And it's getting so close now. It's getting so close. I've been working on it for so long. And I really just want to finish it. I mean, I really do just want to finish it up. And I'm, I'm so close. I'm, I'm right there. Um, so that's one of the reasons why I haven't been posting as much Halo content lately. Is Most of my free time, if, if I have any, is dedicated to that book. Um, but also, I got some other games for Christmas. 
um, that I've been playing a lot of those games as well. And I know it's crazy because I never play anything that's not Halo. But lately I have been playing other games uh, because, frankly, Halo 4 is just its just not the classic that Halo 3 was. Um, you know, Halo 3 was amazing. W when you had Halo 3, you didn't need any other games because Halo 3 was unbelievable. There was no life i no life experience compares to playing halo 3 multiplayer it's just unbelievable there's nothing like it there's absolutely nothing like it but halo 4 it's good but not great and it does get old and they're just not updating it or really making the changes that they need to which is disappointing so anyway long story short i've been playing xcom an enemy unknown that's actually a really fun game uh, it's, it's kind of a strategy based game and if you watch my videos you know I'm kind of a strategy kind of tactical Halo player so that's kind of my mindset and so I kind of like strategy games and so this is actually a really cool strategy game XCOM Enemy Unknown it's been out for a couple months I, I definitely recommend it it's a, it's a good game I've also been playing like Magic the Gathering on the Xbox Live Arcade I know it sounds crazy but I used to play that card game when I was a kid and it's actually like really um, nostalgic to go to play that game. So it's and it's a fun game. It's a good game. Um, and I've been playing what else? Like Forza Three, Forza Four. Uh, I got a new Batman game. I haven't opened it up yet, but a lot of different games. And for the first time in like my, in the first time ever, I've been playing like other games. I never used to play other games, but that's because Halo was amazing back then, and it, now it's just okay. Um, but anyway, I, I don't want to like hammer Halo too much during this video. Um, I just want to give you all a personal update, you know, let you know a little bit about who I am and what I'm doing. And um, again, I, 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 I'm probably going to be slowing down on the tips and tricks videos because my passion for Halo is really just, it's really starting to go down. Um, and I, I've already created like tons of tips and tricks videos for almost every um main every key tip or trick I've already given you probably several times in most of my videos and I hope that they've been helpful for you I'm gonna keep posting tips and tricks videos but at a much slower pace um, I'm gonna focus as much as I can on putting up more spotlights if you have a YouTube channel and you've created videos that you'd like to get a little more exposure send me a message let me know about them and I might be able to uh, post them on my channel so that's something I want to do more of uh, is more spotlights I'm going to keep doing the open game night sessions because those are a lot of fun. They're really rewarding. That's a great opportunity for you to play some Halo with me and my friends. I'm going to keep doing those. So that's something to keep in mind. Keep an eye out for the, the open game nights. Um, I also have I have a, the Halo 4 official strategy guide as well as a, a free uh, Xbox Gold membership. And so I'm going to try to find some way to give these out as prizes. Um, maybe do a Halo tournament or do like a challenge where uh, you know everybody's got to do some you know get a certain number of kills or something like that I don't know do like a challenge or a prize or a giveaway or something so anyway I'll probably be doing something like that as well so I'm still I'm still around I'm still active and doing things but you know just slowing down things are gonna be a little different for a while but I just want to let you all know that I really appreciate your loyal uh, subscription and support. I'm still around, still alive and doing well. Hope you are as well. Uh, you know you know the usual. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Add the video to your favorites. Share with your friends. Thanks for watching, everybody. Halo 4 Tutor signing out. I'll see you next time.